So, this is the sound of EK43, one of the best coffee grinders in the world. Some time ago we get a limited edition of EK43 from Mark Kenny. This is our EK43 limited edition with number 8. Thank you, Anna. Thank you, Bjorn. Thank you, Christian. In this video, we take you on a trip to Hamburg and show you the production of EK43 inside of the Malkenic factory. Our train is approaching. So the journey began. We took the train. We are in Hamburg. After 10 hours in train, we are finally here. Hamburg is with 1.7 million inhabitants, second biggest city in Germany. It serves as an important European port with high quantities of green coffee passing through. But most importantly, the Malkanic factory, our destination, is located here. Let's go inside. We'll show you how the, all the great grinders are made. Come on. So we rang the bell and we are inside. First we said hello to Christian Klaut, senior product manager who is our guide in the factory. Then we met the marketing team of Malkenik, Anne, Marina, Christina and Ranzi. Then we had a meeting with the whole team and what we were talking about. So now we plan the two days in Malkenik and we are going to see all of it. Follow us. Now let's talk a bit more technical. So Malkanik produce various grinders, not only for coffee. Their first on-demand espresso grinder K30 or the latest Sensation P. And what does the word Malkanik actually mean? That was the question for Philip Baumberger, uh, CEO of Hammer Group. Into English means king of grinding, which should come in your mind when you're thinking about coffee grinder is Malkanik. Let the tour begin. Hammer Group has in Hamburg two buildings and two companies. Assembly line for Malkanik but also MK technologies that produce burrs for most of the grinders within the group. And that is what we are going to see first, the production of burrs. Production of some burrs is very automated, but some needs manual work, as it is with burrs for EK43. Before we move to the Malkanik assembly building, it is time to say something about the production. Uh, right now we produce up to 350-400 EK43 a month, but we should have to produce 600. We have ramped up the production quite a lot by, by 100% over the last year. We have to make sure that the grinders are working perfectly. That also means that it takes longer to produce and to pack it focus on the assembly of these grinders. Let's continue the tour. Now we are going to the pre-assembly line. This is the pre-assembly line for EK43. Some parts they get from the supplier, but they always assemble the motor by themselves. So we get the stator, the rotor, back cover, front cover, and we put it together for the first time and see how it runs with all the bearings and so on and adjust all the different screws so it runs smoothly. And then already put it on the main foot or the body. And then it goes to the coating department. Now we are following the process of building of EK43. Once the grinder is assembled, it goes through the process of testing. In the test lab, EK43 goes through the high voltage test, all the resistors are tested and so on. Then they grind the coffee. And then is the time for zero calibration. You hear the burst touching. So this is perfect zero calibration. Once the grinder is assembled, tested and calibrated, it is time to pack it and ship it. Thank you Malkanik for letting us see behind the scene. Now when we experience all the work that goes into the production, we appreciate the grinder even more. So we are back from Hamburg. Hope you like the video. If you haven't subscribed our channel yet, do it now because there is more of these videos. Enjoy. Bye. Bye-bye.